Hey, what is up, guys? Summer here. Today, we're going to be playing some Resident Evil 6 Mercenaries Mode with Sherry Birkin. This is one of the DLC maps. This one is called the Rail Yard. This one is actually brand new. They built this one from scratch for the Resident Evil 6 uh, Mercenaries Mode. They they built two for scratch. They built they, from scratch, I meant. My bad. They, they built this one, and then they built another one. I don't know the name of the other one, but then the other ones, they just ripped from the actual game and then just sold them as DLC, which is kind of bullshit. And, whoop! and that was a nice little fail. That was a nice little uh, fail with that uh, baseball slide there. Let me just, ah, uh, oh, crap, screwed that up, and boom! Very nice. Blew that guy's face. I mean, destroyed that guy's face. Let me just see this guy. Yeah, I'm getting rusty. I have not played Resident Evil 6 in a while, and yeah, man! There we go. That's the nice ass. Very nice. And uh, let's see here. Let's see what we got here. There should be, a, in this area, a ton of these guys show up. I don't know where. They come up from over here. Sometimes they come up from over there. There we go. See? See what I mean? And I think it's wall time. Well, ah, I wanted to slam him against the wall. Oh, well, you're, you're going to slam his face against the wall. I meant, but, oh, well. Actually, whoa. Yeah, this guy. I think with this guy, slam him right against it. Whoa, Very nice. Slam him right against the freaking face. Sherry's like a wrestler. She's like a freaking rust wrestler. You know, she that was like a turnbuckle or something. You know what I mean, and just unload on this guy. Unload on Lumina. Very nice. Yeah, lovely view right there. Let's get that uh, time bonus. Here we go. Broom. Okay, very nice. Okay, shoot this guy right in the freaking balls. There we go. Shoot. Okay, he's dead. Very nice. And uh, let's see here. Let's. I think we should just go right inside the train here, the subway. Let's see what we got here. There should be. There should be a green herb right here. Very nice green herb. And combine it. And boom. Okay, so I am set. The hell was that about? A <laughs> guy was doing like a freaking flip or something. Ah, here's my partner. His name is uh, Fucking Virus Seven, I believe. And it's actually kind of weird. He he walks like he's some kind of a Terminator for some reason. He doesn't he doesn't run, you know, like I'm doing. He just he literally he just walks around. Every time I see him, he's just walking. Like I don't know what the hell that's about. I think he gets. I, I think he's he's like some kind of a. He thinks he's like Nemesis or something from Resident Evil 3 or something. I don't know. I've got no idea. But he's just walking around, you know, just walking around. You know what I mean? And uh. Yeah, if I remember correctly, we don't really... Yeah, see what I mean? He's just walking. Boom, man. That's that. Boom, ma. And, uh, stuck it out. Okay, that guy's done. Very nice. Yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing after I got him on the floor. Just going to unload on their face. It's a hell of a lot better. See what I mean? Yeah, I, I, actually, she's got a freaking amazing gun. She's got, like, probably the best gun in Mercenaries mode. I wish Helena had a gun like this one. That, this gun is freaking awesome. Uh, I think this is the Bear Commander. I think that's the name of the gun. I'm not really sure. And, uh, oh, my God. What the heck? Yeah, we got some kind of giant, uh, gi you know, some kind of giant Kirby balls going around here. What the hell? Yeah, Kirby. Kirby made his debut in Resident Evil 6, apparently. Look at that. Yep, another Kirby. There we go. And boom. Sock on that, Kirby. All right, so Kirby's down. Yeah, we're going to be seeing a lot of Kirby's. Whoop! Got a Kirby right behind me. Hold on a second. Let's take care of Kirby here real quick. Yeah, Kirby's been putting on the pounds, apparently. <laughs> you know what I mean? He's been working out the legs. He hasn't been working out uh, pretty much anything else. He's just working out the legs. And uh, let's see here. we got a nice combo going on here. 30 hits. Very nice. And uh, let's see here. I'm kind of looking for uh, for ammo. I would love to get some ammo. Probably there should be a uh, first aid spray somewhere around here. Probably try to get to that in a little bit. And I uh, took out that Kirby there. That Kirby freaking exploded. Look at this guy. Kicked him right in the freaking face and unload. Very nice. Okay, so there's a time over there. Guys going up. Going down. Hell no. You ain't going nowhere, baby. You ain't going after my friend, fucking Virus 7. He's a good friend of mine. Well, we barely interact with each other, but uh, yeah, he's a good friend of mine. Okay, so yeah, unload on that guy. Very nice guy right behind me. On the, look, what the hell is that guy chopping at? Nothing there. All right, so anyway, boom. Another guy lands right in my freaking face. You want some? Come get some, baby. All right, you got it. And uh, let's see here. Got some ammo. Very nice. Let's get that time. Oh, first aid spray. Very nice. Like I said, boom. -ma. Plus 60 seconds. Very nice. Okay. Uh oh, don't drop the combo, buddy. There we go. Very nice. He did not drop the combo. Lovely. Okay, ammo. Very nice. Oh, shit. I hate these guys. These giant, uh, you know, dung. Oh, my. Counter. Very nice. Yeah, these giant, uh, you know, dung beetles. You know what I mean? That's what I go. Oh, only need to hit, hit him one more time and he's done. Very nice. Okay, so let's uh, let's see here. Let's just go up here real quick. There should be a red herb right here. Red herb. Very nice. And uh, another dung beetle from Conqueror's Bad Fur Day. Took his ass out. Very nice. And uh, let's see here. Time bonus. Uh oh, oh. Shotgun time. Here we go. Boom. Shotgun time, here we go. What's going on over here? What the hell's going on over here? Hold on a second. What's, what's this? What's this? Where's my buddy? Where's my friend? Fucking Virus 7. Look at this. Look at this. There's nobody here. 
What am I supposed to kill? There ain't no zombies or, or Majavo or whatever the hell they're called here. Come on. Where the hell are they? Okay, ammo. Okay, at least you got some ammo. Oh, here they are. Here we go. Oh, yeah, my good buddy here, fucking Virus 7. Yeah, he was hoarding them all for some reason. I don't know why. He was he just hoarding up the zombies. You're not supposed to hoard the zombies up, buddy. Oh, my. Very nice. Guys, freaking face explode and zoom, my. Very nice. And, uh, oh, my. Very nice. Oh, my God. Boom, right in the freaking face. Love the shotgun. That's what I'm talking about. Hell, yeah. Freaking shotgun. Look at this. What the hell is he doing? Counter. Very nice. Got that counter in there. Whoa. Oh my god. Boom, boom, boom. Go for the legs. Legs, legs, knees. That's what I'm going for. Okay, yeah, my name's kind of shit. What the hell? Boom. Very nice. And you want some? Ooh, you want some? Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's see. Reload, reload, reload. And zoom. -a. Very nice. Grab the shot, the, the ammo here. And zoom. -a. Very nice. Lovely. Whoa. Guy took a little chop at me there. Holy shit. Nobody there. Whoa, bat. Don't think so, buddy. Better luck next time. Boom. Got that guy right in the freaking chub, man. That's zub -a -da. Going up, baby. She pulled a little uh, Chun Lee there. You see that kick? Very nice. In this uh, moja. Get the fuck out of here. Very nice. Lovely. And zub -a -da -da. There we go. Doing good here. No, sir. No, sir. You ain't grabbing shit. Whoop. Oh, shit. That guy got me with a chop. <laughs> Whoa. My God. Nice. Oh, my God. That was a nice view right there. And zoom -da. Very nice. Shut him right in the freaking face. Yeah, I gotta heal myself here. Very nice. Heal myself. Um -da. Very nice. Got that guy right in the center of his chest. There was no way in freaking hell he was gonna survive that with that shotgun up close like that. That was freaking awesome. Okay, so where are the zombies? See what I mean? Like the, the time counts when the zombies are gone. And zoom -da. That was just see a boom. Shot him right in the freaking face. Okay, got, yeah, what the hell? These little weird, uh, you know, spider things. What the hell? There's actually a pretty cool counter. You can, whoa! There's actually a pretty cool counter you can do with these spiders where they do, like, some kind of wrestling move. Like, like they, they do, like, some kind of, uh, I don't remember the name. They do, like, some kind of, uh, uh, I don't remember the name. It's, like, some kind of a uh, takedown or something. I don't know. I think, no, I don't remember the name. I don't know. Yeah, I'm kind of rusty when it comes to, uh, you know, to wrestling, you know, moves and whatnot. But, uh... Yeah, I'm actually, no, the counter has to be insanely freaking, this this is probably the tightest counter, the timing for this counter is insanely freaking tight. Probably the tightest counter in the entire game, w without a doubt. And the zoom, very nice. So I got screwed up here by the spiders, but it's cool. I wanted to do the cool counter. I couldn't get it, unfortunately. It doesn't really matter. I have a lot of stuff here to heal myself with. And boom, ba -ba, very nice. Get some shotgun shells. And, okay, so there's a guy with an RPG here. Hold on a second. Guy with an RPG. Uh, guys, yeah, we're going to get a little uh, Bulbasaur evolution going on here. Look at that. We're going to ignore that for now. We're, we'll be dealing with the Bulbasaur in due time. You know what I mean? We're not playing Pokemon Go here. We're playing, uh, you know, Resident Evil 6. But, uh, you know, speaking of Resident Evil 6, this DLC map is actually pretty cool. I like it. I like the rail yard. You know, the, no, don't drop the combo. Oh, my buddy dropped the combo. Yeah, it's his fault. Oh, there's the Bulbasaur. Oh, my God. Went for a little, uh, I don't know what the hell that was. Bulbasaur has been taken down. There we go. Very, very nice. It's actually been a while since I played Resident Evil 6. I freaking love this game, to be honest. I'm thinking of getting more uh, more modes. And I ain't got space for the green herb. Hmm. That would have been kind of useful. Bulbasaur. Get that counter in there. Very nice. And Zagada right in the chest. Okay, he's still alive, actually. Can't believe it, though. Okay, so get hit that guy right in the freaking chest as well. That's that's the main area you want to... Oh, shit. There's a guy with an RPG. Let's take care of the guy with the RPG. Yeah, sniped his ass. Very nice with the bear commander. Lovely. And, whoa, what the hell? Guy pulled some kind of Jackie Chan move. What the hell was that? Pulled a Jet Li move right there. Started doing some, you know, some fancy kicks. You know what I mean? He, yeah, I was over here, buddy, by the way. And, oh, there's my buddy. There's my uh, friend, uh, fucking Virus 7. And he's got zombies after him that he didn't kill for some reason. I'm load on this guy. Very nice. Guy had no chance whatsoever. All right, so the combo. We kind of dropped the combo, but it was a good combo, though. We were, like, at 86 when it was dropped. Okay, another green herb that I can't grab. That kind of sucks. Yeah, I kind of need that green herb, to be honest. Um, It will come in handy. Blew that guy's freaking face off. Nice. All right. Yeah, let's just start tossing flash grenades. Yeah, I want, I want that herb. Um Pull the Chun Lee kick right there. Very nice. And unload on um Another Chun Lee kick. Very nice. Another two. Yeah, throw. Throw the thing. Throw it. Throw it. Throw it. Throw the goddamn. There we go. Put this here. Okay, here we go. And zoom -da. Explode. There we go. Very nice. Okay, now we can combine this. More herbs. Lovely. Just what a doctor order. Freaking dung beetle from Conquest Bad Fur Day. Wow. He just freaking exploded. I don't even know why. I didn't even know these guys could explode. Guess I must have hit him in his weak point or something. I don't know. You know what I mean? Uh, I hit its weak point for massive damage. 
Oh, I apologize for that little snort there. I'm a little bit under the weather as I'm recording this. But uh, anyway, okay, so whoa, let me just help my friend here. Holy crap. You see what he was doing my buddy here? Holy crap. Oh, let me, just, yeah, let me just heal my buddy here real quick. He's looking like shit. Here you go, buddy. There you go. You're welcome. Don't say I never gave you nothing, buddy. <laughs> All right, more dung beetles from Conker's Bad Fur Day. Take their asses out. Wow, we got like three of them. Holy shit, he's got a sweet gun going on there. He's got like some kind of elephant killer or something. I don't know. You know what would have been great in this game? We would have gotten actually the character Wesker to be able to use him. I don't know. Yes, I know that he's dead. He died in Resident Evil 5. He was killed. Doesn't matter. I'm talking about something optional, like completely optional. Just boom, Albert Wesker. You unlock them. Here you go. Use him. Nothing to do with the story, nothing to do with the, you know what I mean, just use the character, you know what I mean, like, this, just a little bonus, you know what I mean, now, uh, his son is cool and all, but I want to use the real deal, you know what I mean, I want to use the, I want to use the father, you know what I mean, alright, so, they, in my opinion, they shouldn't have killed Wesker, to be honest, in my opinion, one of the coolest characters, like, you know, for, like, freaking ever, like, from Resident Evil 1, Wesker, probably the most badass human being in the history of Resident Evil. The, the most badass character, without a doubt. And then they just killed his ass. They had Chris killed his ass in that lava or whatever in Resident Evil 5. It's kind of silly, to be honest, you know what I mean? But, uh, you know, that wasn't me. You know what I mean? I wasn't there, you know what I mean? When they were, uh, you know, making that decision. Oh, yeah, let's kill this really cool character that everybody likes. Yeah, just kill him. Yeah, it's not like we're going to need him, you know, for plots, fraud, plot advancement and that sort of stuff in future Resident Evil games. No. Alright, so anyway, so yeah, I, I kind of knew that the writing was on the wall for Wesker when I started playing Resident Evil 5, because he was the main villain. When you have, I knew, I was like, oh my god, they got, they have him as the main villain, he's probably gonna get killed in this one. And then, lo and behold, I got to the end, and that's exactly what happened. Alright, so, alright, so we got some more Kirby's here, whoa, my buddy's in trouble, my buddy's in trouble, there we go, I gotcha, buddy, I gotcha, don't you worry about a thing, there you go. You're all good, buddy. You're welcome, buddy. Don't say I never gave you nothing. Whoa! Guy pulls a friggin' Jackie Chan move on me. What the hell is up with that Jackie Chan move? God damn. We're actually almost done here. We just gotta take out six more of these guys, and we're done. Look at this. We are literally done. I think this is an S ranking right here. Without a doubt, this has got to be an S ranking. Boom, boom. Shoot this guy in the friggin' face. Oh, my God. Gotta reload. Sherry's full of blood. And, whoa, guy does the Jackie Chan move, and, uh, boom, don't, no, no, I did not ask for a strip tease, okay, buddy? And we are done. Very, very nice, lovely. Okay, so what's, what's the score here? And we got that S, very, very nice, lovely. Okay, this is a great game, this was a great DLC map, Rail Yard. I'll be playing some more of the, the DLC maps in the future, and I'll be loading them as well. So if you're still here, thanks a lot for watching, I appreciate it. Uh, don't forget to hit that uh, subscribe button, but the most important thing is to enjoy the content itself. Later.